welcome dear students let us continue with the remaining chapter in this video subject maths standard 7th chapter 5th topic operation on rational numbers module 2 let us recall the definition of multiplicative inverse we have already seen this definition in the previous video let us revise it to divide one number by another is to multiply the first by the multiplicative inverse of the other for example minus 5 upon 4 multiplied by minus 4 upon 5 we get answer as 1 similarly minus 7 upon 2 multiplied by minus 2 upon 7 we get answer as 1 thus we can say minus 5 upon 4 and minus 4 upon 5 also Minus seven upon two and minus two upon seven are the pairs of multiplicative inverses. That is, minus five upon four and minus four upon five, and also minus seven upon two and minus two upon seven are each other's multiplicative inverses. The product of minus eleven upon nine and nine upon eleven is minus one. Therefore, we can say that minus eleven upon nine and nine upon eleven is not a pair of multiplicative inverses. Thus, we have seen the definition of multiplicative inverse. Let us start with the next topic, that is numbers in between rational numbers. Now. Let us look for a rational number between the two rational numbers one upon two and four upon seven. To do that, let us convert these numbers first into fractions with equal denominators. Now, as you can see, one upon two and four upon seven both have different denominators. So first, we need to convert these different denominators into equal denominators, and then we can proceed further. we have already seen how to convert into same denominators that is by using lcm so we have to take the lcm of 2 and 7 now lcm of 2 and 7 is 14 so 1 upon 2 in the denominator we have to bring 14 here it is 2 so if you multiply 2 into 7 you get 14 now when you multiply in the denominator with the number 7 then in the numerator also we are going to multiply with 7 so 1 upon 2 will become 1 into 7 upon 2 into 7 which is equal to 7 upon 14 similarly 4 upon 7 in the denominator we want 14 so when you multiply 7 into 2 you get 14 now if you multiply in the denominator with 7 into 2 then in the numerator as well you have to multiply with 2 so the fraction will become 4 upon 7 is equal to 4 into 2 upon 7 into 2 which is equal to 8 upon 14 now we know that 7 and 8 are consecutive natural numbers consecutive natural number means that after 7 immediately the number which comes which is that is 8 but are 4 7 upon 14 and 8 upon 14 consecutive rational numbers the denominator of any number can be increased then the numerator also increases the same number of times now multiplying the numerator and denominator of 7 upon 14 and 8 upon 14 by 10 when you multiply numerator and denominator of 7 upon 14 by 10 you get answer as 70 upon 140 and when you multiply the numerator and denominator both by 10 of 8 upon 14 you get answer as 80 upon 140 now we need to find the numbers between 7 upon 140 70 upon 140 and 80 upon 140 so now as you can see the numbers which lie between 70 upon 140 and 80 upon 140 are this So, how many numbers do we find between seven upon fourteen and eight upon fourteen? The number is nine. Now, multiplying the numerator and denominator by hundred, 
so we get 7 upon 14 when you multiply numerator and denominator both by 100 you get answer as 700 upon 1400 and when you multiply numerator and denominator both of 8 upon 14 by 100 you get answer as 800 upon 1400 now when you find out the number between 700 and 1400 uh, 700 upon 1400 and 800 upon 1400 there are many numbers which lie between these two numbers so thus you can conclude that when rational numbers get converted into equivalent fractions with increasingly bigger denominators more and more rational numbers which lie between them can be expressed that is in simple words when we increase the denominator and the numerator the numbers which lie between those two rational numbers also goes on increasing. Set 23. Write three rational numbers that lie between the two given numbers. First, 2 upon 7 and 6 upon 7. So we need to find any three rational number that lie between these two rational numbers numbers solution the given numbers are 2 upon 7 and 6 upon 7 we know that between 2 and 6 the number which lies are 3 4 5 so now dividing the entire numbers by 7 you get 2 upon 7 is less than 3 upon 7 is less than 4 upon 7 which is less than 5 upon 7 which is less than 6 upon 7 Hence, three rational numbers that lie between 2 upon 7 and 6 upon 7 are 3 upon 7, 4 upon 7 and 5 upon 7. Second question, 4 upon 5 comma 2 upon 3. So, we need to find any three rational number that, that lie between 4 upon 5 and 2 upon 3. Now, a first step over here is to check whether the denominators are equal or no. Now here the denominators are not equal. Okay, first rational number has denominator 5 and the second one has denominator 3. So first we need to convert into same denominators and then we can proceed further. So let us convert these numbers into fractions with equal denominators. So 4 upon 5, we are going to multiply the numerator and denominator part both with 6. So we will get 4 into 6 upon 5 into 6 which is equal to 24 upon 30. Similarly, we are going to multiply the second number 2 upon 3, numerator and denominator both with 10. So, we will get 2 into 10 upon 3 into 10 which will be equal to 20 upon 30. Now, we have both equal denominators. So, we can find the numbers or three rational numbers that lie between these two rational numbers. Now, we know that between 20 and 24, the numbers that lie are 21, 22 and 23. So 20 is less than 21 which is less than 22 that is less than 23 and which is less than 24. Now we are going to multiply all the numbers or we are going to divide all the numbers with 30. So we get 20 upon 30 which is less than 21 upon 30 that is less than 22 upon 30 that is less than 23 upon 30 which is less than 24 upon 30. So we have found out the three rational numbers that lie between 20 upon 30 and 24 upon 30. But we know that 20 upon 30 is nothing but 2 upon 3 and 24 upon 30 is nothing but 4 upon 5. So we can say that 2 upon 3 is less than 21 upon 30 which is less than 22 upon 30 that is less than 23 upon 30 which is less than 4 upon 5. So hence three rational numbers between 2 upon 3 and 4 upon 5 are 21 upon 30, 22 upon 30 and 23 upon 30. Next is the third question. 
minus 2 upon 3 comma 4 upon 5. So we have to find the rational numbers, the three rational numbers that lie between these two rational numbers. So let us start with the solution. The given numbers are minus 2 upon 3 and 4 upon 5. Let us convert each of the given numbers into fractions with equal denominators. So I have told you earlier that the first thing we have to check is the denominator. If the denominators are equal, then you can proceed further. But if they are not equal, we have to convert the rational numbers into equal denominators and then uh, find the answers further. So now here the denominators are different. That is 3 and 5. So we have to convert this into equal denominators. Now, minus 2 upon 3, if you multiply both numerator and denominator with 5, you get answer as minus 10 upon 15. Now for the second sum, if you multiply minus 4 upon 5 with both numerator and denominator with 3, you get 4 into 3 upon 5 into 3 which is equal to 12 upon 15. So as you can see, both num denominators are 15. So now we can proceed further. One is minus 10 upon 15 and second is 12 upon 15. So we are going to find out the three rational numbers that lie between these two rational numbers. Now we know that minus 10 is less than minus 9, is less than minus 8, is less than minus 7, is less than minus 6, is less than minus 5, is less than minus 4 and goes on which is less than 1, 2, 3, 4 which again goes on which is less than 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. So between minus 10 and 12 this many numbers lie. Now next thing we are going to do is we are going to divide all the numbers by 15. So it will look like minus 10 upon 15 which is less than minus 9 upon 15 which is less than minus 8 upon 15 which is less than minus 7 upon 15 which is less than it goes on to 1 upon 15 which is less than 2 upon 15 which is less than 3 upon 15 which is less than 4 upon 15 that goes on to less than 12 upon 15. Now instead of minus 10 upon 15 I have written as minus 2 upon 3 and instead of 12 upon 15 I have written as 4 upon 5 because both are equal. So we can replace it. Now we have to find out any three numbers which lie between these two numbers that is the minus 2 upon 3 and 4 upon 5. So this many numbers lie. So we can pick any 3 of our own choice. So hence the 3 rational numbers between minus 2 upon 3 and 4 upon 5 are minus 9 upon 15, minus 7 upon 15 and 4 upon 15. So I have picked up these 3 rational numbers. Next is the fourth question that is find the numbers, find the three numbers which lie between 7 upon 9 and minus 5 upon 9. Solution. So the given numbers are 7 upon 9 and minus 5 upon 9. Now we know that the denominators are same that is 9 for both the rational numbers. So we can directly proceed further. There is no need to convert into denominator into same denominators because the denominators are already same. So now we know that minus 5 between minus 5 and 7 this many number lie. Minus 5 is less than minus 4 is less than minus 3 is less than minus 2 is less than minus 1 which is less than 0 which is less than 1 which is less than 2 less than 3 less than 4 less than 5 less than 6 which is less than 7. So between minus 5 and 7 this many numbers lie. Now we are going to divide all the numbers by 9. So it will look like this. Minus 5 upon 9 is less than minus 4 upon 9 is less than minus 3 upon 9 is less than minus 2 upon 9. It is less than minus 1 upon 9 which is less than 0 which is less than 1 upon 9 and goes on till it is less than 7 upon 9. So now we can pick any three rational numbers between minus 5 upon 9 and 7 upon 9.
So I have picked up, hence the three rational numbers between minus 5 upon 9 and 7 upon 9 are minus 4 upon 9, 0 and 6 upon 9. You can pick any three of your own choice. Next is the fifth one. We have to find the three rational numbers that lie between minus 3 upon 4 and 5 upon 4. Again, the denominators are same. So we can proceed further. Now we know that between minus 3 and 5, this many number lie. That are minus 3 is less than minus 2 is less than minus 1, which is less than 0, which is less than 1, which is less than 2, which is less than 3, which is less than 4, and that is less than 5. So between minus 3 and 5, this many number lie. So now we are going to divide all the numbers by 4. So it will become minus 3 upon 4 is less than minus 2 upon 4 is less than minus 1 upon 4 is less than 0 which is less than 1 upon 4 which is less than 2 upon 4 and that is less than 3 upon 4 which is less than 4 upon 4 and is less than 5 upon 4. So now we can pick any three rational numbers that lie between minus 3 upon 4 and 5 upon 4. Now hence the three rational numbers between minus 3 upon 4 and 5 upon 4 which I have picked are minus 2 upon 4, minus 1 upon 4 and 3 upon 4. Next number, sixth question that is we have to find the three rational numbers between 7 upon 8 and minus 5 upon 3. Now the first thing you can see is both the denominators of the both the rational numbers are different that is for 7 upon 8, the denominator is 8 and for the number minus 5 upon 3, the denominator is 3. So both rational numbers have different denominators. Now as I have told you earlier that we have to convert this into equal denominators and then we can proceed further. So solution, the given numbers are 7 upon 8 and minus 5 upon 3. Now let us convert these numbers into fractions with equal denominators. So now for first rational number 7 upon 8, we are going to multiply numerator and denominator both with 3. So we have 7 into 3 upon 8 into 3. 7 into 3 is 21 and 8 into 3 is 24. So we get 21 upon 24. So the rational number 7 upon 8 gets converted into 21 upon 24. Now next rational number minus 5 upon 3. We are going to multiply numerator and denominator both with 8. So we have minus 5 into 8 upon 3 into 8. Minus 5 into 8 is minus 40 and 3 into 8 is 24. So rational number minus 5 upon 3 gets converted into minus 40 upon 24. Now 21 upon 24 and minus 40 upon 24 both of them have equal denominators that is 24. So now we can find out any three rational numbers which lie between 21 upon 24 and minus 40 upon 24. Now we know that between minus 40 and 21 many numbers lie. So these are the numbers which I have written. Minus 40 is less than minus 39 which is less than minus 38. It goes on to which is less than minus 13 which is less than minus 12 that is less than minus 11 that goes on. 2 which is less than 11 which is less than 12, 12 is less than 13 is less than 14 and it goes on to less than 17 which is less than 21. It goes on till 21. So we have many numbers which lie between minus 40 and 21. Now we are going to divide this entire numbers by 24. So we have minus 40 upon 24 is less than minus 39 upon 24 which is less than minus 38 upon 24 it goes on to which is less than minus 12 upon 24 which is less than minus 11 upon 24 that goes on to less than 11 upon 24 which is less than 12 upon 24 that is less than 13 upon 24 which goes on to which is less than 17 upon 24 and that also goes on to which is less than 21 upon 24. So there are many numbers which lie between minus 40 upon 24 and 21 upon 24. We can pick up any three rational numbers. 
So now instead of minus 40 upon 24, I have written minus 5 upon 3 and instead of 21 upon 24, I have written 7 upon 8 so that it will be easier for us to find out any three rational number that lie between minus 5 upon 3 and 7 upon 4 because 7 upon 8 because the question is same. So hence three rational numbers between 7 upon 8 and minus 5 upon 3 are minus 13 upon 24 comma 11 upon 24 and 17 upon 24. I have picked up these three rational numbers. You can pick up any three of your own choice. Now the last question of this exercise that is write three rational numbers that lie between 5 upon 7 and 11 upon 7. The question is very simple. The denominators are already equal. So there is no need to convert this into equal denominators. Now solution, the given numbers are 5 upon 7 and 11 upon 7. Now we know that between 5 and 11, the numbers which lie are 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. So 5 is less than 6, which is less than 7. 7 is less than 8, 8 is less than 9, 9 less than 10 and 10 is less than 11. So between 5 and 11, this many numbers lie. Now we are going to divide all these numbers by 7. So we have 5 upon 7 which is less than 6 upon 7 that is less than 7 upon 7 less than 8 upon 7 which is less than 9 upon 7 that is less than 10 upon 7 which is less than 11 upon 7. We can pick up any three rational numbers which lie between 5 upon 7 and 11 upon 7. Hence three rational numbers between 5 upon 7 and 11 upon 7 are the three which I have picked are 6 upon 7, 8 upon 7 and 9 upon 7. I hope you all have understood the sums and liked this video. Thank you.